Good morning everybody. Um, actually it's just nearly afternoon now but um, apologies yesterday for the delayed upload of my video. As I explained I had a nightmare uh, day and didn't film till the afternoon then Facebook crashed. <laughs> so you'll get two things today. Um, there's only three songs today because I've got to do the 26 and I don't want to be left with like one on the last day so um of course, as always, just to prove that I'm doing it today, um, it is it's 12.27, I've just finished actually, uh, it's Friday the 1st of May, and I hope that you enjoy the concert. I will remind you again, as it's the 1st of May, actually, it's a very special month, it's Ayla's Danos Awareness Month, particularly important as I'm raising money for the Ailers Danlos Support UK charity, which is the only UK EDS charity, um, solely UK I should say, um, it's the 2.6 challenge and every single penny goes to them. Um, they have been amazing supporting me when I first got diagnosed and I now volunteer for them and help others and next month is volunteers month, like awareness thing. Um, but I would like to add that um, these times are obviously crazy and um, yesterday when I went to a and &E, um, my car for ages has had battery issues where if you don't use it for a while it just doesn't start, it just doesn't turn over. So you have to jump start it and then after a bit of a run it's okay. Um, but yesterday because we don't live far from the hospital, um, when we got when we we're coming back from the hospital it wouldn't start again and we were lucky that Adam's work colleague could come and... Um, and jump start my car again but i was really worried because i thought if we have to go somewhere urgently again and my car won't start then it's just a nightmare so um i put a message out on our community group this morning asking if anyone um, knew of anyone who could come to me and replace the battery and within literally two minutes i had loads of replies but this one amazing lady she saw it and her husband actually works for the garage I usually take my car to anyway and he's been furloughed and I would like to say a massive thank you to Matt Collins um, I'm sure he won't see this but um, he came out within the hour like he went luckily the part the battery was in stock he got it at cost price and obviously I paid him extra because he was amazing he came uh, I left my keys he got my keys I trusted him to go and replace the battery, he dropped the keys back and I paid him online so there was no contact at all and it was just amazing so I now have a new battery in my car so I'm really pleased about that and I just want to say thank you to everyone who's doing kind gestures like that had it been normal times I probably would have had to wait weeks and pay a lot more and definitely for someone to come to my house um, but yeah so this song is dedicated to all those amazing people who um, are helping out others at the moment whether it's neighbours friends family anyone um and this is one of my favorite songs and uh, this is don't stop believing by journey
<laughs> um, the next one, um, I'm going to do a John Williams one. This is my final John Williams one um, because tomorrow I think I'll probably do a Queen one. Um, I'm not sure yet. But this one is a more well-known one, which is Hedwig's theme from the film Harry Potter again by John Williams. years um i actually had to learn it from memory because it's very very hard to read the music and play it's um it's a michael nyman piece actually i was into michael nyman way before i now be and he again writes a lot of film music um mostly film music and this you recognize if you've ever seen the film the piano um it's also been used in other stuff but um this is called the heart asks pleasure first Thank you. 
hope you enjoyed that. Um, for anyone who knows the full version, there is a longer ending, but that is very hard. <laughs> and I've never played it. And um, yeah, but I love that piece. There's lots of pieces that I love, but unfortunately I can only do 26. Um, one thing I did want to mention though is that I was talking to my mum yesterday and in this lockdown time people have saying they're enjoying the piano playing concerts challenging so after this um once i've done my 26 songs and raised the money i'm for my own no fundraising or anything um every two weeks i'm gonna do a 20 minute concert um and upload it to facebook um so you can submit requests for songs also um i should do my own um like choices i might even throw in my own compositions as well um but i thought every two weeks is good or if you want it every week then i might be able to do that but i don't want to commit to something that i'm just like nah um or forget but i might try we'll see how we go um it's definitely easier than every day because <laughs> every day um, I'm recording in the morning, uploading in the afternoon, editing, blah, blah, blah. So it takes the whole day to do this. Um, and today I intend on resting for the rest of the day. Um, so please remember to donate. Um, I'm doing a request tomorrow for somebody. So if you have any requests, let me know. I've, I'm going to be doing, um, although the challenge started Sunday last week, I'm playing up until Sunday this week. So technically it's eight days, but... The challenge finishes on the 3rd, which is Sunday, so um, I hope you're all doing well, keeping safe, staying home, all of that, and please donate, the link's below, and I hope you all have a great day, bye!